Great to see those two Great Danes doing uh, so well, and they have a bright future ahead of them. Fostering is difficult because you have to make that decision when it's time for them to find a home to let them go. It's not easy. East Greenbush view of the uh, skyline of Albany on this uh, cloudy evening. It was cloudy all day long. It looked like it wanted to do something. It never did. Now, the winter storm impacts with this storm tracking south of us. And this red area, we're pointing out tomorrow that this red area uh, around and just north of New York City, the lower Hudson Valley into Connecticut, into the Boston area, that's where we expect a, a high impact from snow and heavy snow. Notice how that impact drops off significantly, only limited around here with a little dusting of snow, maybe a light coating, flurries and light snow, that would be it. 38 in Albany, 34 Glens Falls over to Johnstown, Manchester 30, Great Barrington 36, uh, 34 Hudson, Albany um, at 38. We got into the uh, low 40s today. Whitehall 34, mid 30s Hebron to Queensbury where it's 37. Uh, 31 from Kathy up there in Long Lake. Out to the west, Caroga Lake 31, 36 in Galway, Dwaynesburg 33. Hessville, mid 30s. Tim Beebe there in Del Mar, 39, 31 on the hill in Grafton, 36 Hoosick Falls to Bennington and Adams, 31 from Bill Mahone in uh, Lanesboro. Tonight, 31 in Wyndham, upper 30s around uh, Germantown, Hillsdale, Jeff in West Stockbridge at uh, 35 degrees. Quiet for now. Look at all the clouds and moisture to the south of us, but it's not pushing north. It's sliding off to the east-northeast. So another indicator that uh, this storm is having a hard time making northward progress. Now, we'll track off to the east-northeast intensify as it gets up close to Chesapeake Bay late tonight and early tomorrow morning. We'll take the future cast and the track of that storm off the Delaware coast tomorrow morning. Here's the band of moderate to heavy snow, basically Kingston South, lighter snow and flurries up to the capital region. This storm's going to move very quickly. So by midday, it could essentially be winding down for the Hudson Valley West, and then that storm races out to sea. So this storm is only about six to eight hours, a coating to two inches. And I think the best chance of one or two inches south of Albany, southern Columbia, southern Berkshire counties, two to five possible. As you get south of Kingston, five to eight. And as you go into the suburbs of New York City, over to Providence, south of Boston. This is the area that has the best chance of getting 8 to 12 inches of snow. Highs tomorrow, mid to upper 30s. 36 Glens Falls, Bennington to North Adams, mid 30s. Albany tomorrow, 37 and 38 at Johnstown. Our forecast, 30 tonight. A little bit of snow developing south of Albany, early morning hours. Tomorrow, a little bit of light snow or flurries here. Steadier to the south and east. It should be winding down by midday, 37. Valentine's Day, cold and dry, 32. Late day snow or snow showers, Thursday, 35. Flurries into Friday morning, 36. The weekend, both days, snow showers. 30 Saturday, cold on Sunday, 25. Partly sunny Monday, 31. Trishna? All right, thanks so much.